Welcome back guys to another episode of me going off on a bit of a rant and we are here at the root of evil the forums for forged to fight and today's topic we're mainly just going to be focusing on the lack of communication and general stupidity so let's go ahead and dive right in and uh, first off guys i don't really post that often here on the forums mainly just a lurker i think i've had like a total of like three actual posts last year and i've commented like twice this year <laughs> and here on the forums recently all we've seen is just basically players posting questions asking like for you know give us a hint some sort of info on future bots that are coming any sort of changes any new content any updates and a lot of these threads get closed without any in information anything useful given to us any glimmer of hope that you know stick around guys you know we got huge things planned for you but nope nothing absolutely nothing and anyways there's there was one post that i was keeping my eye on uh it was posted i think like two or three days ago by synthwave let me find it oh here it is and i was just waiting for that little moderator tag to be posted on it so i clicked on it and let's see let's go up here uh basically synthwave he's just asking for uh, how about updating the AM rewards now that the Waspinator exploit has been fixed? How about updating the rewards to include some tier 3 alpha essence? And also how about putting some new bots or mods on the map to celebrate the rewards update, which we desperately need in my opinion. And I'm sick and tired of Primal, Waspinator, Cheetor, and what is it, Dinobot and Rhinox on opposite sides at the end of section 3. And I feel like us as players, we shouldn't have to ask for things like this to happen i feel like they should have some sort of calendar or rotation put into effect where every three to four months something like that we need to rotate the maps around switch out the bots the mods update the rewards a little bit and just keep the player base happy you know keep them entertained keep uh, give them something new and it, it doesn't happen we basically have to beg for it and I was just waiting, like I said, for a mod to comment on this, and we did get a reply. We got a pri or Vidius commented on this. He says, just wanted to swing by and let y'all know that we're passing the suggestion slash feedback along to the team. How many times have we heard a response like this, guys, and nothing gets done? Plenty. There have been plenty of responses like this, and nothing gets done. I don't know if you guys remember the change log that was posted on September 5th. Basically, they knew that we were upset with 7.0 and they wanted to expedite certain things uh, like increasing the commander level to 60, introducing the daily missions for tier 3 uh, class spark essence. And I think pretty much every single one of those has been met except for the tier 4 night crystal that has yet to be introduced. Uh, I have seen posts asking for information on the tier 4 night crystal and those completely get overlooked. Uh, either they get closed or no sort of information from a mod comes on those posts. So it's just infuriating to me. Uh, so anyways, I decided <laughs> to give them a bit of a sarcastic uh, quote reply. It said, thanks, Vidius. Only took a couple days and posts to get it passed along to the team. On a side note from a closed thread, can you ask Mike exactly what he meant by we're always working on new content and ways to keep the fight interesting and engaging? Please remind him this isn't MCOC. <laughs> you know, total sarcastic post. And then, I didn't know this, uh, Kitten says, Rip Inko Sly. Totally butchers my name, but it's alright. I love it. Keep, uh, keep doing it. <laughs> and basically, what I found out, and obviously I can still see my post, but if I sign out, and I go back into that thread. Let's go back into it. Uh, where is it? I basically don't see anything. I don't see my post anymore, which means, you know, it was taken off. It was removed. It was censored. I didn't get any sort of notification. Um, I don't know why. Even now, I don't know why it was removed. I didn't get a message about it. I didn't get any sort of notification. And real quick, guys, the little side note that i added i was referring to this post down here 
It was basically a genuine post in my opinion. It just asked for Kabam in general to shed some light on us and let us know that they're not letting this game die, that they're, they have things planned. And it was genuine in my opinion. And this is what, this is what Mike says. We're here. Like we've said before, we update you guys as soon as we have news to update you guys on. I know that you guys want more info on the daily, but unfortunately, unless we have something to announce, we'd just be making stuff up. Which, the way I interpret that, they don't have anything planned for us. <laughs> they don't have anything, man. They don't have anything. Uh, let's see. We're Basically, we're about to hit the third week of November, and they don't have anything planned. or There is no hype, basically, for if they do have content for December, I feel like they should have announced that already, or maybe it's coming next week. I don't know. But give us something, man, some sort of hope. And the kicker here, the really the big kick to the nuts is we're always working on new content and ways to keep the fight interesting and engaging. Rest assured that as soon as you have we have news to share, we'll let you know. Mike, replacing the contest with the fight doesn't mean that statement belongs in this game so i don't know why he added that it's in my opinion like i said a huge kick to the nuts a slap in the face everything you can think of total disrespectful in my opinion nothing has happened nothing interesting or engaging has occurred in this game since pretty much april when the anniversary hit and the real kicker guys the 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 funny thing that <laughs> that I read today as well was uh, a screenshot from uh, Sneakerhead. Uh, he basically got he got a warning from uh, Kabam Spice uh, for his uh, his post on discussion content. He says, "So now that MCOC got all these updates and new content, can you guys at Kabam start working on this game again?" Everyone knows that Forge Divide is a redheaded stepchild that gets no love, but <laughs> FFS. Uh, the poor kid gotta get some kind of love once in a while. Your new offices should be organized by now. If you guys don't know this, Kabam basically got like these new offices, and yeah, it's a huge brand new building that they got. Pretty sure this game is paying for their three hundred dollar DX racer chairs. Um, I don't know, <laughs> but that's just my uh, my thoughts. Uh, MCOC got its update now. Start on some new content on this game, please. <clears throat> you have such a loyal fan base here, although not as big as MCOC maybe, but I know people spending good money here, and to prevent it from dying, we need something new. Since 5 stars came out and Tier 3 Alpha and Spotlight, almost everything needs the rewards boosted. Arena, which now it's like a huge pain in the butt for me, I rarely do Arena anymore. AM, Act 4, Act Away Missions, and Calendar. He says, uh, give us something to look forward to early in 2019 like mcoc does and we'll go to the second screenshot he says uh, i promise then you won't have so many people leaving then again this would assume you guys at kabam even care about this game for from the lack of communication content development it's obvious you don't you should either make both games great or sell Forge Defy to a company that will not drive it into the ground and you can then you can focus on not killing two games at the same time since MCOC instead of decline two. <laughs> he gets warned from Kabam Spice. Oh boy. Seeing this, honestly dude, Kabam Spike Spike Kabam Spice is a moron and just flat out an idiot. He basically says, your post has been deleted for breaking the following rule. And then this guy, ha the irony, man. He sends him a link to Contest of Champions. If you don't want us talking about MCOC or even bringing up MCOC in the forums, why the hell does this guy give us reply to him with a link to Contest of Champions? I'll do you, I'll do you a favor, Spice. Um, real quick, dude, if you want to come in here and go scroll down a little bit i know you know it may take some time away from mcoc but here on forum rules um i see a huge list of things that probably could have uh, could have happened but this is the link you should probably should have sent to him um you might want to send it to me as well since my post got censored and i didn't even know about it no notification no nothing um <clears throat> yeah you know what send this to me i'll post this in my video description you know you can just send it to me in uh here in game 
uh, whatever you do. And let me know which one of these rules I broke. Um, I would love to know. But um, yeah, here I, you know, I'll, I'll link it to you basically, so you can send it to a bunch of people that break the rules on the forums. Uh, but yeah, guys, it's just super infuriating watching that. Oh man, this just made my my blood boil basically. <laughs> and uh, oh my god, it's so stupid. Like I want, I really, really want to weigh the pros and cons in this game. Like as much as I try to play it over and over in my head, like okay, like this game at its core has some really good gameplay mechanics, you know you know the 3d fighting it's amazing the bots in general are really cool it's the lack of content the lack of everything the lack of communication in particular that have basically just huge nosedive into the ground for this game and if you guys just a little bit more let's go over here into the home page and we'll check out the news Uh, game updates. Um, so they update the news with just the bot intel report, but this section here, game updates. If I'm an, if I'm a brand new player, I'm gonna want to go to the game's main site, and I'm gonna go here, and I'm gonna check out game updates. And this is what I'm gonna see. I'm gonna see this. The latest post that they have here is the 4.0. I think it's 4.0. One year anniversary for Forge to fight since April 3rd guys almost seven months ago that they updated this this section of their main site for this game and <laughs> this was uh this was the last bit of hope we had in my opinion for this game ever since then it's just been stagnant steady decline and something else that they did have was like these little uh these little like discussions here for like the new bots bumblebee came out last Christmas and here you have Ernesto and Howard talking about Bumblebee. You know, they ask questions, answers. You know, it's it's an amazing thing to read, in my opinion. Um, I don't know where Ernesto went. Maybe he got fired. I have no idea. We don't see him anymore. Um, I remember reading this one when I was, you know, pretty new. <laughs> and it says, the fear of Galvatron. And then, you, see, you know, Ernesto here says, Galvatron is as deadly as he deadly as he is insane which of his special moves do you feel captures the essence of his madness his special two from addy says uh, is a great example of his raw strength going from the backhanded punch into the gun on his arm blasting his opponent that sounds awesome man it got me super hyped up for galvatron it was uh, sad that he was complete crap when he came out but he's a little bit better now which uh yeah that's better for him but this in general like these little discussions they're really good to read uh, as far as like for the new bots and we don't get any of this anymore nothing has been updated here and revitalizing this in my opinion would be a step in the right direction uh, but yeah man going back to the forums it's it's just a complete clown fiesta in my opinion everything gets censored things get closed and we don't get any information as far as December goes, guys, I have no idea what they have planned. We could be getting Bumblebee, we could be getting Shatter, Dropkick, Blitzwing, maybe Lockdown, but who knows, you know, they might accidentally release Ultron or Sentinel. You know, th those guys kind of look like robots, right? Kabam's over there like, yeah, those kind of look like Transformers. Close enough, release them. Release them, boys. But <laughs> that'd be completely hilarious. I could see that happening in, uh, in this life, but... I just, I am honestly speechless. I really don't think I'm going to be posting here on the forums anymore, guys. Uh, I'll just, you know, keep being a lurker, just waiting for the, the day when they eventually uh, say something as far as, like, content goes. And the other thing that, the very last thing that really, really upset me was the fact that we didn't get any anything for Halloween. We didn't even get like a spooky crystal like they did over in MCOC. I really wanted my uh, my premium bot crystal shards. Those would have been really nice, but it just goes to show that they have no interest in this game. Uh, the communication mainly, and I remember back in like April, they, they even gave us like a free two-star bot. I would have appreciated that on Halloween. I would have seen this that as a complete... Uh, you know as a trick but it would have been a nice gesture like hey guys here's something completely useless for for halloween even i think when bumblebee came out last year they gave us like a free two star or something like that and some other little goodies like energy refills and things like that but nothing and i'm pretty sure we can expect nothing for thanksgiving uh 
gift wise from Kabam, uh, gifting still isn't a thing in this game, and I'm pretty I'm pretty sure what we'll get though next next week is uh, deals Black Friday deals. So I'm I'm I just cannot wait to spend two hundred dollars, three hundred dollars, four hundred dollars on this game, get those amazing amazing deals. So yeah, keep them. Uh, I really can't wait for that Kabam. That's one of the things I'm looking forward to. And you know what? Maybe I should start a post on Black Friday deals. Actually, you know, I think there's already one. Uh, I had I had seen one. Yeah, Black Friday deals. There we go. I might go comment on that. We'll see. Uh, see what we get. Actually, you know what? I'm not commenting. I said I'm not commenting anymore, and I'm gonna stick stick to that. So, don't expect anything else from me on this uh, shit show of a forum. Yeah. But anyways, guys, that's gonna be it for me today. I apologize for the rant. Um, it feels a lot better once you just completely let everything out and hopefully you guys got some chuckles from particularly that screenshot from uh kabam spicer linking uh that guy a, <laughs> a link to contest of champions man so stupid what a moron anyways guys i will see you guys again one of these days